Hi, I'm Dr. Finian Varney, and I'd like to talk to you about this item. It's a rail-based shoulder mount system designed to make it easier to hold small cameras steady, even whilst moving. Its precision engineering and sturdily built frame make it a market leader at its price, and the ergonomic controls enable the operator to swiftly balance the components, maximising stability and comfort. It's the little touches that really make this piece of kit. The whole thing fits together nicely from the moment you unpack it. First of all, you need to mount the first rail grip to your camera. The grip accommodates both the 5 and 7mm universal screw threads. Most cameras use a smaller 5mm thread, which will screw directly into the base of your camera. Use a screwdriver to ensure your camera is securely attached. Now you can slide the rails through the holes, using the tightening adjustments to lock them in place. Next you need to secure the handle to the front of the rails. Simply slide the handle bracket over the rails and secure as demonstrated. The handles feature an intelligent ratcheted design, meaning you can lock them into place securely. The final piece you need to attach is the shoulder mount and chest rest. Slide the rails through the holes like with the first rail grip and secure similarly. Slacken the knob on the shoulder mount and another ratcheted cog will lock the chest piece into place. Whilst using the system, the shoulder rest should sit comfortably on your shoulder, the chest piece resting on your ribs with a little slack in your arms to allow for movement. In this position, the camera should naturally be horizontal and face straight ahead. The easy to adjust controls make fitting the unit to anyone a quick, simple process. Now let's see how it holds out in the real world. Welcome to Kirkham Proud, an Augustinian establishment set up by Walter Lespec, living in Helmsley, in the early part of the 12th century. Although a ruin now, this was a thriving establishment until the dissolution of the monasteries under Henry VIII in 1540. It's hard to believe really in these days of very rapid change that for the 400 years the uh, priory was in existence, it would have changed little. Indeed, the Victorians, when they built our sewage systems in the early 19th century, were much modelled on the sort of systems that we can see here in this site today. We used the shoulder mount system when shooting this documentary on the technologies of the monks. It enabled us to smoothly follow the presenter around locations and get tripod steady shots where a tripod would not have been practical. This next film demonstrates the advantages of using the shoulder mount system when shooting in a guerrilla style. So we're now outside Steve Matthews' house. We're going to confront him about some of these accusations and see what he has to say for himself. Nice one, yeah. So what we should do is when he comes out, we can just bow straight in. There. Quick, come in. Mr Matthews, how do you respond to allegations that you've been using illegal materials such as asbestos in the construction of schools? No comment. Do you have anything you'd like to say to the families of the children who now attend the schools your company has built? No comment. How can you remain silent when an independent inspection has clearly revealed the shoddy workmanship employed by yourself? Turn that camera off. No comment. Do you have any further question at this no. time, Mr Matthews? No comment. Mr Matthews, thank you very much for your time. The shoulder mount system enabled steady shooting throughout the duration of filming. Earlier, student filmmaker Ray Morgan spoke to us about his experience using the shoulder mount system on a recent project. Right, so we used this, this particular piece of kit on a recent shoot for a university project. We decided to do a music video um, and it really kind of came into its own while we were moving around the party. It was very, very handy in terms of being able to use the smaller camera on this as opposed to setting up a tripod for every single shot. We also were able to kind of cruise around the party and really you know, get, pick up the vibe of the place and, and, and make it look as though it was a, a guest at the party that was moving around the house. The, the fact that we were using a smaller camera meant that if we were going handheld, we would have had a lot more shaky kind of uh, point of view. But on, with, this, with this kind of shoulder mounted system, all, all the shots looked very steady and very, very kind of professional. I really would recommend, um, for its price, in the kind of range that it's in, it's a perfect piece of kit. Not only is it extremely well engineered, it's very easy to use, very ergonomic, very intuitive. The design is simplistic, 
You also find that if you need to make any alterations while you're actually filming, you can do this without sacrificing the shot. So with literally dozens of uses across spectrum of genres, this really is a quintessential piece of kit for any budding filmmaker. Thank you and goodbye.